Hi guys. So it's a new makeup day, so don't look at me. Anywho, um, just wanted to remind you that tonight is the pink moon, the blood moon. And I don't know what area everybody's in. So it really just depends on on that on what time. But you can look for it anytime after um, 12 o'clock. If you're in Jacksonville, Florida, I can tell you it's going to be around 3, 3.30, 3.40, and um, it'll be ended by 4.23. So you really want to be out there. If you want to see it, you want to be out there at the the 315 320 mark I am going to do my best I have bags under my eyes oh my god so awful because I haven't been sleeping but um I'm going to do my best to be out there I'm pretty sure I won't be asleep I have the most horrible sleeping pattern right now so a little update on the garden so we're renting a tiller this weekend because it just massively ended up being too much. The box that we got that I showed you pictures of, it has a, um, it's a greenhouse effect. And what you do is you, you know, you put the little seeds in there and they start growing. Well, it happened so fast. I don't, <laughs> I expect it because when I see people doing seeds, it usually takes like a month to seed something. So me and my friend were like, oh, we got time. It's okay. Mm, not so much. So Saturday, we're going to be running the tiller. I'm going to go out there tomorrow and plant some of the stuff in the actual box. The tomato plants are looking great. I think I need to put more soil in the box because it doesn't look like... um. It looks like the the soil is kind of cracking, so I'm not sure if... Get down! Arwen! Arwen! Get down! I am so sorry. He is climbing my curtains. He's lost his mind. Okay, so where was I? So, um, the soil looks like it's cracking, so we think that maybe I didn't put enough soil into there so I'm gonna go buy some potting mix tomorrow and maybe put some more on there um, I don't know what else I could have been doing wrong so that's the only thing I can think of because like um, I watched the video on building the garden box again and it looked like they actually filled to the brim and maybe I didn't I don't really know lack of sleep is killing me so let me think so okay so that's what we're going to do we're going to put some more of that and then we're going to plant some of the things that have really grown like the broccoli and the okra have just taken flight i mean they're like this tall i will show you definitely tomorrow when i go out there um so I think it's okra, broccoli, I'm not quite sure what else, but it's really, it's, it's rather, rather tall. And then on the other side, we had stuff like cantaloupe and things like that, and it has started growing, really. We, we thought, oh, well, maybe something was wrong with those seeds, so, well, no, they were just a little bit slower than the others, but they are starting to grow massively, too, so... I need to definitely put what I can in the box, but we <laughs> always the overabundant people. We put 72 little things of seeds, and well, that means now 72 things of seeds are ready to be planted. So I need to figure out exactly how I'm going to do it. Probably some of them are not going to be planted till Saturday. Um, a friend of the family also gave us some squash, some, another tomato plant, and cucumbers, and there was one more thing, but I can't remember what that was, but, um, 
he gave us those, but we're going to actually leave those in the pots because he had already seeded them. So we're going to leave them in the pots until we till on Saturday. So it's coming along really good. It's just going a lot quicker than we thought. And I wasn't prepared because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Let's just be honest. I have no clue what I'm doing. So that's basically it. So come Saturday, we'll definitely be able to... Show, well, I'm, I'm going to show you tomorrow what the greenhouse little thing looks like. And it looks like the cilantro and the other herbs that we planted, the oregano. I planted two cilantro, one oregano, and it might be some basil. Gosh, I don't know without looking at it. We've got so much stuff actually seeding that I have no clue. And so the pepper... The banana peppers are coming along great too. I honestly want to get some jalapenos because that's actually pretty exciting for me. We have a bucket that we're going to plant those in and just leave those. The banana peppers are in a separate bucket and we're going to have the jalapenos in a separate bucket and we're just going to have them sitting on the porch growing like that. As well as I think we're going to leave the herbs. We're going to get containers like terracotta plants and put those in those because I think those will do really great because you don't need a huge amount of space for the herbs so I'll definitely take you with me and show you tomorrow so that's basically been it today has been a majorly busy day it's doctor's appointments and then going to my friend's house and trying to help her create a shadow box it was actually pretty fun it is finished I'm not going to show you her shadow box though because it was like personal for her and her boyfriend but it was pretty neat and um so um diet not so good <laughs> tomorrow restarts my Atkins because you know I had bread I had bread I don't know it, it was a weakness because I don't even like bread so I'll keep you posted on that. I don't know what I'm going to have tomorrow. Maybe I'll share it. It's, you know, it's been a really difficult eating right when I've been busy from sunup to sundown. And like today, I didn't even eat until 4 o'clock. And that's not healthy. It's not healthy at all because, you know, your body goes into the starvation mode. And it's like, oh my God, you're starving me. I'm never going to eat again. So when you do eat after that mode, it just automatically comes up into, um, I'm going to just hold on to that because who knows when you're going to feed me again and that's, that's not good either. So we'll see. I got to get myself back together and I got to get in the, get back in the gym because, you know, this gardening has been very tiresome and very backbreaking and I don't know, it, it just seemed like every time I would, you know, start to go home the last thing I wanted to do was go to the gym so whatever but anyway that was just a little update and um, thanks for watching y'all have a great day and don't forget that lunar eclipse if you want to see it bye